Hi Gator, so the Majestic Rider. So I'm going to show you the sidle up with a horse that hasn't been doing it very long because they can get confused and it might help you just to see what I do. I'm very friendly. <laughs> okay, I do like to put the reins over their head before I get there. That way I can just get up on the mounting block. A lot of these horses come and uh, you try to line them up and they don't line up very well and I teach them to sidle up and then I just start doing all sorts of different things with the mounting block and grooming them and stuff so they get used to standing next to it. bend her neck very well to the right, so I like to give her a little uh, reward on the right side. Then just stand next to the mounting block and make it a big thing. Everybody wants to get on and walk off. That's why it's a good thing to do on the day you're not going to ride. Because then you're not in a rush to go anywhere after you get on. And remember, they love being scratched. They don't like pats as much. But many times, well, she went a little too close, didn't she? Many times they get confused at the mounting block because people are rushing it and you're moving around too much and you're giving them all these signals and you don't know you're giving them the signals. Let's get back in here. So many times people are having problems with the mounting block because they're in a rush to get on and then go ride with their friends. The horse moves, they get agitated, they move around too much, the person does, and it confuses the horse. So it's just one step at a time. Take everything slow and quiet and make it a good experience and just break it down for the horse. But I've seen a lot of people, they go to side a lot, the horse kind of knows it, and then they get up there, they don't hold the reins, they raise up their hand, the horse just walks off or just walks forward. You got to block them with your hand and then direct, you know, your left hand block them. And then you're using your other hand to give them the signal to come over. But I only just hold my hand up. Then if that doesn't work, then I wave it. Okay? So just one thing at a time, especially smart horses and sensitive horses, they can get over. You can give them too much stimulus, and then they get confused. Okay? The duller ones are different. But the ones that are sensitive or know, if you start moving around too much, you're actually giving them signals, which you don't know you're doing, and that's why they keep moving around. Okay? Good girl. So just get on, sit, scratch them, and let them settle, okay, before you ride off. Okay, hope that helps when you're teaching the side a lot. If, uh, you know, you're having issues once you get away from the wall and you're getting to the mounting block, but slow and steady and 